Now I am going to demonstrate what is mean by servo motor. The servo motor is having this encoder and this DC motor. This is a DC motor. This encoder checks the speed of this DC motor and it will give feedback. If it is closed loop, then this feedback is obtained from this encoder. Now we are having two modes in this controller. Here I will set reset here now it is AC DC now check it is DC enter now it asks for forward or reverse we are giving forward then enter now I will demonstrate open loop now the actual speed is now we can't set speed but it can display the actual speed. Now I am going to increase the speed slowly. Give run. Increase the speed. We can't set the speed, but we can check the speed. It's a difference between open loop and closed loop. Now the sensor senses the speed and it is displayed here. We can't set the speed. So this encoder feedback is not obtained here in this open loop. Whereas we are going for closed loop. Closed loop, you reset, we are closing DC drive, enter. Now it is forward or reverse, give it for forward. Now closed loop. Closed loop, give it as default settings. Now, I am going to set the speed of 300, 300, 300, Now, start. This system is giving feedback to this controller. The speed of this shaft is 400 or 300. Now, the system is going to balance this actual value and this set value. And finally, the system will balance and it will reach. Now, it is trying to balance the two values. Now it is a balanced speed. Now the system have balanced the set value and this actual speed, actual value by giving the feedback by encoder.